Um, hello, everyone. Glad to meet you all. My name is Natalie Kang. Um, I'm in charge of Global Marketing Manager in SPH. Um, today, I'm talking about the benefits of pipeline analysis solution in the utility industry, especially in gas industry. First of all, I'd like to briefly talk about our company, SPH. SPH was founded in June 2009. Um, in 2011, we began working as a Google Maps partner and was selected best global partner for Maps. In 2013, we leveled up to be a premier partner. That year, we signed a Korea exclusive distributorship with Supermap. In 2015, um, we started partnership with Carto, a location intelligence platform headquartered in Madrid and New York. This year, we've been expanding our business to the cloud service, then started official partnership with Monday.com, which is a global collaboration platform company headquartered in Israel. So um, what is pipeline analysis? Um, let's talk about this first. So pipeline analysis solution, actually we named it PLUS. Um, is the in introduction of numerical analysis technique into the gas industry. The input elements used as the uh, basis for the models are gas pipes, valves, and gas governors. The gas pipe model is represented by the flow equation, which is Q. We can calculate the flow rate, flow velocity, and pressure in the pipeline using numerical analysis. So if you apply a mathematical model like the left side picture to the entire city, it will look like the right side picture. So pipeline analysis solutions are used by various departments in gas companies. The sales staff will determine whether there is economic visibility when a new gas supply area is created through pipeline analysis solution, which is a plus. And construction, construction site, the construction staff use plus to determine the construction method of piping for installing new gas facilities. They can simulate how they will actually do their construction. And safety site, safety staff use plus for isolation valve analysis and stability of supply pressure. City gas companies have been using pipeline analysis solutions since the early 2000s. The following is a breakdown of current concerns about the existing solution. The customer's concern was that there were few specialties in the pipeline analysis solution and the solution was expensive. Moreover, the modeling work for the pipeline analysis takes such a long time, so it was time consuming and inconvenient. The core direction of our solution, which is a plus, was to use DMVGL's Synergy Solver to provide a way to reduce the cost of the solution while ensuring the reliability of the pipeline analysis results. So let me explain about DMVGL company first. DMVGL is the leading provider of risk management and quality assurance service to the maritime, oil, gas, and power and renewable industries. Um, DMVGL digital asset ecosystems and software solutions supports business like critical activities across many industries for ships, pipeline, processing plants, offshore structures, renewables, electric grids, smart city, and more. Synergy Gas is proven solution used by Korea Gas Corporation and many city gas companies. What's the difference between Synergy Gas and Synergy Solver? Synergy Gas, which is well known in the market, is an integrated application consisting of charts, reports, data models, and engines. 
Senior Storbo is a component that you uh, that can utilize your data model and engine. In other words, Synergy Cost is Sorbo's killer app. So Sorbo is a modeling and simulation engine. The same analysis results are obtained as with Synergy. The reliability of the analysis results can be secured, therefore relatively reduce product licensing costs this is good reflection of what we said, the core direction of development. The combination of server and SuperMap I objects configures a new solution plus. We use the SuperMap I objects as a GIS engine. They provide facility data management and error correction. It displays flow rate flow velocity and pressure analysis values in the pipe. In that regard, we analyze, analyze the pipeline analysis work procedures at many city gas companies in Korea. The basic data for the analysis are GIS-based facility information, such as pipes, regulators, valves, etc., and Customer gas uses information from the seat gas company. The data model consists of basic information, connectivity, and properties of each facility. The file format uses the MDB file format. There is a modeling tool called Model Builder in Synergy Gas. However, many companies develop and operate their own pipeline analysis support, support software to replace this function because additional license cost is required. In other words, we figure out that almost all gas companies are operating two channels. One of them is a program to create modeling data and another is an analysis program. When we create modeling data, which is MDB, and render analysis during the initial test, we obtain perfect results as the sample data. But when we test it with city gas company's actual data, which is an operation data, it took about 13 hours to load the file, even though it was not that big data. And we didn't get the analysis result in the end. So we need to go deeper into the process of creating the data. The GIS engine for GIS facility management and pipeline analysis was unified to reduce errors related to GIS data. And also the model conversion model was implemented in PLUS. So when we looked into in detail why data modeling was difficult and took a long time, the major issue was connectivity. GIS facility data is created in CAD, converted into GIS format and used in analysis software. The CAD software output itself is not a big problem, but it can be a problem with the pipeline analysis software. There are five main types of problems. The first is a pipe undershoot, which pipes are not connected. Pipe overshoot, which pipes are excessive. Pipe endpoints not connected. Facility loss connectivity with other pipes that is an orphan facility. And last one is pipe loop. If we have a lot of this kind of data, we will not get the analysis results in a typical pipeline analysis solution. Therefore, the, the automation tools which are snapping and splitting are used to motiv modify these data. With the concept of GIS tolerance, snapping and splitting can be performed in general pipeline analysis solution. In case of snapping, Two lines may be connected or unconnected, depending on the setting value. In the case of splitting, it costs the pipeline when, when it is in the area or analyze to place the regulator in the pipeline 
or discard the data. Also, this is an effective tool for data calibration for the user. However, errors may occur depending on the tolerance setting value. So we found out that the most effective way would be to use tolerance from GIS rather than using tolerance from pipeline analysis solution. By implementing the various topology features provided by Supermap, we are able to perform data modeling tasks accurately. After solving this problem and commercializing, the software configuration is like this. The core function of PLUS are data modeling module, steady state analysis function, error check function for data purification, and analysis report function. It also supports the gas safety management task with the situation analysis module for risk management. So this is one of case studies from Korea. JB Corporation is one of major city gas company here. This year, JB Corporation has been using PLUS. So uh, pipe flow rate, velocity, and pressure analysis, which previously took more than a week, has been drastically reduced to two to three hours. This obviously increased customer work efficiency. Currently, customer satisfaction with PLUS is very high. This is because it provides an emergency situation analysis function that is twice faster and more accurate than the existing system. From now on, I will be showing the demo clip, which has a summary of what I've been describing so far about PLUS. Um, this is how PLUS looks like. So um, PLUS provides um, map tools, data interpretation, data analysis, data validation, and more. So uh, this function shows how to extract spatial data. So when extracting data from the database, it will automatically find and fix the data with errors. So after extracting pipe valves, gas governors, buildings, and UCS data required for pipeline analysis, the error data is automatically corrected. Then it creates a um, network data set. So it finds data with error and auto-corrected data and displaying them in a table. Selecting a list in the table will take you to the location. And this function is to create an analytical data model used for pipeline analysis using the extracted data. It reads the extracted data and enters the data into the pipeline analysis data model with UC's mapping. This is a function to perform pipeline analysis using the generate analysis data model. When the pipeline analysis is completed, the pressure, flow rate, velocity, and direction of the pipe can be known. So this function allows you to check the analyzed results on the map. Yeah, I think this is all. So it can be used to check the pressure flow rate and velocity of selected pipe using the proper property inquiry function. These are 
these are everything. And this is all from my side. So if you have any question about PLUS, just scan a QR code or um, find us on the Supermap Korea website and we can send you the PLUS English version of brochure and further ex explanation about our solution. Thank you.